Hi, I'm Morgan. I'm the technical program manager for the hardware team, the electrical hardware team. And essentially what our team is responsible for is building the control units that control all the electronic and mechanical subsystems in the vehicle. Today I'm going to be kind of going through basically a few of the boards that we have that are in progress right now. Uh, I'll start with our battery management system and that allows us to do active, ba active cell balancing instead of passive cell balancing and that's going to give you your faster charge time, uh, less heat signature and that's going to allow for longer battery life which is essential for this guy right here, our work truck. This right here is our M board. This M board is basically our control unit for the motors and most of the drive functions on this platform right now. If you follow me, we can, I can show you what the original motor board looks like. And this is our first revision, second revision. So this board right here is basically replacing this entire system. And so as you can see, as we continue to develop, we are getting better at packaging and finding other components to do what we need them to so we can operate more efficiently. Next, we have our Omega board, this little green guy right here. This is essentially the nodes in our network that go on each board that allows every board in the system, to in the entire platform to communicate with each other. So as you can see right here, we have an Omega board right here and we have an Omega board that will be placed on our MS board right here so that all everything can communicate with each other using automotive ethernet. As the electrical hardware team continues to grow and develop these boards, keep an eye out for new videos with the design engineers of these boards and they'll take you on a deeper dive of what these boards are actually capable of and how they're unique in the electric vehicle marketplace.